looking at more stickers. What else is new? Don't need any. Kind of like these ones though. Ooh, I like those ones. Wonder if the spackles come off. Hmm. We found Sti as a target. I mean, where are we? Walmart. I feel like the back seat of Sti is completely creepy. literally asks for just a coffee. Let's stop up. They have a veggie wrap. Why hello Rebel of the Sands. I did a book review on you. If you have not already got this book, I highly suggest going and buying it because it was really, 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 really good. I'm getting City of Heaven and Fire and Hogwarts Princess to finish my other collections so I can start reading them. But they don't have the same covers as the other ones, so of course that's pissing me off. Like, eh, what are you gonna do? Live with it, right? Right. And then I didn't know they were releasing any hardcover again. Hmm. Oh well. Found the off system stuff at Staples. I didn't even realize that they sold it here, but I want to get mini discs. Not right now, but soon for my Mondi Happy Planner. They have cute little, oh my god, this is adorable. Like the little stuff they have. Because I believe these will fit the Happy Planner if I'm not mistaken. Just picking up some Dawn at Home Depot. What? Or some mixed fruit drinks. You guys need help? No, thank you. Just looking. Just looking. Oh, and they have the cutest stuff here. And the Michaels. Like, how cute. More pictures and stuff. Letters. Oh, look at this journal. Wow, that journal will last you for a long time. I think the water made it worse. You don't feel well? Like oh. What is this little thing? Is this, is this a tape measure? Hey mom, look it. It's a little tape measure to keep in your purse. I think I have one. I have Dylan's, not my purse. <laughs> it's so, yeah. So weird. Oh, look at how cute. What are these? Oh, they're little push pins. Little diamonds. This is just mom's cat creepily watching TV. Apparently, she likes awkward. What? Okay, so I just went to the doctor's and I went to Dunkin' Donuts and they forgot to put my sponge in my coffee, but I felt bad because they were all like rushy, rushy. So I'm just gonna go home and put some in. Probably like Trudy or something. I'm breaking out awful. Um, little background is I'm on some medicine and I've been on it for a long time. And, there, and now we're in the, well, now I'm off of it. Like they tapered me off and I'm gonna start a new medicine. But in the process, I'm getting all these side effects, which is why I've been sick for the past like week. And uh, one of them is my cystic acne is coming back with a vengeance. 
So I'm hoping that the new medicine that the doctor is prescribing me will work. Um, yeah, so basically I suffer from anxiety and depression along with a multitude of other things. And um, yeah, so there's a little about me, I'm sure. I've mentioned the anxiety before because it's like a big problem for me. Literally walking to the doctors by myself was never even like a thought in my head like six months ago. And now I walk to the doctors and I walk home by myself. So I'm like super paranoid too that like people. <laughs> Uh, my life, man, my life. <laughs> and I'm sure you can hear the wind. But, yeah, you know, um, a lot of people suffer from anxiety and depression, and some people choose to go on medicine, and I'm one of them. Um, if you're not, like, I don't, whatever do what's best for you is what I always say and medicine seems to be the best for me unfortunately that one has run its course I've been on it for gosh I don't know like two years or something so yeah Try, trying something a little different I felt the effects of the depression get back at me so yeah but there you go, I have my two plain donuts because I'm extremely nauseous. And I'm, I know that's not gonna help, but I just wanted two plain donuts, okay? I just wanted two plain donuts. <laughs> so I'm going to go home and have my coffee and my donuts, my two plain donuts, and just relax for the rest of the day and wait until next gets out of work and he'll come pick me up and I'll go back yeah so that's just a little bit of what's going on in my life at the moment and I mean honestly like having a mental illness and stuff is not anything to be ashamed of so I figured I'd just like get that out there and let you guys know that's like why I've been sick and stuff so, yes, it is also a uh, hashtag, so that's Eric's Readathon. And I'm more than halfway through City of Bones, which is okay because I didn't know how far I was going to get. But now I'm just going to finish walking home. And I will talk to you guys later.